If you want to outline a motif with a straight line, but you want it to be a smooth line, then stem stitch is a really good option. So today I'm going to stitch this little tulip motif with stem stitch. Welcome to Evita Studio. My name is Elizabeth and I help you make beautiful things with quilting, hojagi and embroidery. So this tulip motif lends itself to stem stitch because of the curves that are in the design. With stem stitch, you'll get a smooth line on the curves. So I'm stitching the middle line of the motif first and I begin with a kind of a back stitch. I bring my needle back part way and then I continue to take stitches that go up and then back overlapping the stitch that is before them. So I'm putting the needle in on one side of the line and bringing it up on the other side of the line, keeping care that the thread stays on the same side of the needle at all times so that the stitches stay lying in the same orientation. When I get to the end of that line, I will just finish that off and then start another line in the same way. And I'll work this line continuously all the way around the sides and the bottom of the tulip. Then I'll just work the rest of the lines in the same way. So here it is all finished and you can see how it looks on this curved part. And when you see it side by side with the back stitch variation, you can clearly see the difference that comes from overlapping those stitches slightly. The back stitch has much more distinctive stitches and the stem stitch gives a smoother line. So enjoy using stem stitch to stitch simple motifs and be sure to check out my other videos where I show this motif stitched with different stitch options. For this and other embroidery tutorials and inspiration, be sure to check out ebitastudio.com.